hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to know about the string function before this we have already understand about the string and concatenate so today's uh, we'll just explore the same topic in uh, some another way like there will be many things we are going to discuss related to our live projects also so this is very very important topic whenever you will go for live projects these things are going to use and I will tell you when and uh, how we have used means uh, I have used in uh, my tire tasks and all in life tasks okay so here uh, you will see like uh, we are just comparing this is capital this is a, a small letter okay so these things we are going to compare again we are going to just uh, uh, means uh, make it equal how we can make both are equal we know that this is a small letter this is a capital letter sometime maybe this one equal sometime may not be this one equal so how we will make the equal and why we are using why we need to make this equal and all okay like these things or uh, you can see it here like uh, we have passes some uh, like how we can replace our uh, uh, letters in the okay in characters and all and how we can just add some another uh, character how we can extract uh, and uh, replace all how we can remove also some symbols are coming in whenever you'll go for live task project there will be some symbols in your uh, uh, like uh, if they will give you some data and in data there will be some similar symbols so you need to remove those data and uh, then you have to uh, go for the next step like uh, you have to make your uh, extract the data in uh, array format or something else this time these things are going to come and sometime there will be some extra spaces sometime you need to make the spaces in your uh, targeted and all so we all the these things are we are going to understand in this uh, lecture okay so let's start okay i will run this one and i will show you and then i will just compare everything to you so run a java application okay let's start from here the length of the string 2 is avina 7 okay so first of all i am what i am doing i am just calculating the length if i am passing any uh, int Int sorry if I am passing any string okay and I need to compare those things so how we will compare okay, see this is your uh, okay a string one avinas and here I am calculating a string two value avinas so a v i n s -S. this is seven letter okay if I will put some extra spaces then what will happen let's uh, save it and run it so it will become eight okay because whenever you go for programming and all your space is also count okay see this is looking avinas 7 but this is 8 why this is it because in programming in coding i have put some extra spaces so this will count as a extra okay now uh, so you understand that uh, if you are putting any extra space also this is also counting okay as a character now you understand these things okay and next what we are doing see here avinas and avinas are not same so when we can make them same this is also a question yeah obviously these are not same but when we can make them same and uh, what will be the processor process to make them same okay so to calculate the length of any character you have to pass uh, same like this a string to your string dot length and bracket in this way you can calculate the length of your string okay this is the way to calculate the length of the string and to compare any string these are equal or not what will you do a string one see this is my string one okay this is a string one and this is a string two a string one dot equals a string two in this way i can just calculate the length of them so let me run this one because i have make some changes last time okay so here you can see string one is capital string two is small okay now i'm comparing string one dot equals string two this way you have to put this way why we need to sometime uh, if any user they don't know how they have passed the data in capital or small like uh, see if you are searching something if you if you have the list of something okay otherwise if you are searching someone on facebook okay so you don't know that person has put their name in a capital letter or a small letter you are just typing okay and that will suggest you their name okay understand so in that cases we just uh, need to uh, perform these cases okay so exactly they are not same that capital and small they are not same so what we have did here is string one dot equals system two we have just compared they are equal or not okay this is a small one uh, case i just show you that uh, on uh, some uh, social media you are searching someone name something you are searching and you don't know that's capital letter but just you are putting and that will suggest you the exact things when that will suggest you the exact thing i will tell you so in that cases what we are doing exactly they are not equal so here it's written they are not same it will go for uh, this one because uh, I have put the if condition if they are equal it will print this one are same 
if they are not equal it will show that uh, they are not same okay so for to make them equal what we are doing we are just doing using equal ignorance case okay so you have to put your string one dot equal ignorance case string two okay so in that cases it will just neglect it's a small letter or capital letter okay it will directly just compare the uh, means exactly what is this is a and this is it will compare it will not go for the small letter and capital letter okay so in this case you will find that we are getting our same in equal ignorance case i have put it here see avinash and avinash are same in equal ignorance case i have just ma make some uh, characters in the double quote so to under for understanding purpose so if any uh, character letters are not same okay they called same but they are not same like uh, there is small in capital letters so you can use that uh, dot equal ignorance case to make them equal okay this is one case now what we have did comparing hello <coughs> and maclo distance minus 5 how it came in see if i have defining if i have defined some uh, you can see it here so the character at position 2 is i how this is if you want to calculate the character positions like i just told you that if you are putting a space that will also count as a character okay so if you want to find the uh, means uh, which character at the in the form of index because whenever you will go for the any uh, string or something how it's starting first will count as 0 then 1 then 2 okay then 3 4 it will always it will start from what it will start from 0 okay so here also same thing going so i want to know the which character as two second place okay zero one se two okay so for this what i will do for this one uh, i have just did it here see if i am calculating character two place so i have to go for the string okay our string uh, that uh, which is for which string i am going to find that string dot caret and bracket you have to pass your index place value okay so which index you want okay so i am i am looking for second one so i have passed here two you can go for three four as you want okay so i have go for two and it will show you here like i i how it's i because it will start from zero zero as a one as v and two as a i okay so same i have got here two is i okay now i am comparing a string to hello and maclo I have defined some different different string you can go for your uh, as much you want means what whichever string you want I have compared string 2 and string 3 okay so comparing is 2 and string 3 distance okay so how to compare this string 2 you have to pass your string value dot compare to and your next string value is 3 okay this is minus 3 and it has compared given the minus 5 uh, okay so how is you can count h i j k l m if you will go for this one like uh, h i j okay sorry h i j k l m you can see here 1 2 3 4 5 6 means you will go for 0 1 2 3 4 5 okay it will come in minus 5 so it's going in a decreasing way like uh, it's comparing from uh, m to h okay so you can see here h i j k m to m to h okay so that's why it's giving minus 5 to you 0 i say that will go in minus way and it's giving minus 5 to you and uh, you can just this is not too much important but uh, we need to compare that time also it's in in another way not in that way that much okay and now i am just going for i have created one another string also some another string uh, you can see it here and uh, in next what i am doing you can see here i am just uh, going for the string abc start with the ab true if you have a uh, means if they have you have a list of strings okay and you need to find that uh, which are true means uh, if you want that those string which are starting from some particular specific letter that will count as a true or if uh, you will extract them okay like this so in that cases what will you do okay so you need to pass some like if you want the some string value starting from b in c or this you want to stack them. so in that cases what will you do you can uh, just put it that start one dot start with a b so you can get all those words okay or uh, you can find that this word is true or not okay so i have passed here string one dot start with a b if this word is starting from a b then this word will be true okay and same in that was end with also if you I want to just uh, find that this word is ending with particular specific character or not so for that i am just passing end with 
okay these are the small small things and uh, these are going to come in your life task also so for understanding purpose only just understand no need to mug up these things okay you can get these things uh, that time also but you need to just get clear with the ideas no need to no one is going to i will just tell you whenever a developer is uh, one year two year experience also they are not going to mug up anything everything is available on google they are just going to understand the things like yes there is a way to find these things okay they will go for that so you don't don't need to uh, like mug up this uh, like keywords and start with and with and you when you will go for uh, again and again it will come in your practice and you will understand these things okay if you want to replace some like if you want to replace something okay and when we are using the replacing and all see here i have used for a string one dot replace here i am replacing here it was what a b and i have replaced this one with x y and when and why we need to replace sometime okay sometime we need to replace the things by blank space also okay so when i will tell you uh, the, from client side we are getting the raw data raw data is coming in uh, not in proper format like there will be multiple symbols like hyphen spaces or uh, some extra spaces or some uh, extra symbols like this so we don't require that time the extra symbols and all in that cases we are just using these things like uh, dot replace and we will put that sign which because whenever they are giving the raw data we need to check one time the what is the raw data, how is the raw data format okay and as per the raw data format we need to remove the extra things which are not required for all uh, like a programming and so that time we are using these things because their main data will be same but extra things which are not required that will be replaced so how to do this so you have to pass your string okay and then replace okay and then you have to uh, just uh, pass your which value you want to remove okay and by which value you want to remove okay so i want this one instead of this one so for that i will go for a b comma then double quote and x y okay in that case it will remove the which one i don't want and it will just give which i want understand and now uh, next is like if i'm just uh, passing, okay and second is the string to from 0 to 4 string to sub string 0 to 4 okay so in that cases what will happen you can see here like uh, i have defined here a string to value a string to is java dot class with avinas okay so in that cases what i want i want some string value and another i don't want i other i want to just uh, remove and i i want to extract only 0 to 4 value to so how it will happen 0 to 4 in the sense 0 will come 1 will come 2 will come 3 will come 4 and after the 4 everything will be got replaced means it will remove okay so see here java dot class is with avinas okay 0 j 1 a 2 v okay and 3 will be a fourth will be dot okay so i have pass here 0 comma 4 and how it will happen a string to your string dot sub string 0 4 okay so in that in that way what i will do like i will just extract 0 to 3 only and 4 and after 4 will be got extract remove okay so you can see here i have got here java only and why i'm just doing this like i have wrote the code before and uh, before itself because it will take long time for you and you will get bored also so that's why i have just written the code already and directly i'm just uh, giving you ideas for this one okay and you can get if you will comment i will uh, make uh, this code available for you also so no need to worry i will just put this code in description itself if you required okay so and next is the string one this is the test testing okay so in that cases you can see here i have just used uh, you can see it here in that way we are getting some time data also like extra symbols will be there just a uh, front slash back slash these things will be there okay so i don't need these things okay so for that cases uh, what i will do i will just write a string okay i i am counting this one as a string so that time also you can uh, there will be rummy, uh, dummy data for you so you can make all the data like a string and you can just put the this symbol like uh, whatever symbol you have you have to just put that string dot split and that symbol okay so it will remove the all uh, unrequired useless symbol okay so now you can see it here what we are getting hmm. you can see here i have uh, printed here this is a test string this value we are getting here okay so for this one i have just uh, make it uh, like a, a string i have created here a string array a split array equal to a string one dot split okay and this one hyphen okay so it will just remove all the things okay 
and then I have uh, got this one. So you can get this one in another well. So like if you want this thing in single line, so you need to just remove that ln, and you will get all the things in the single line. Uh, if I will save it, and you will get it here, run as Java application. See here, the things are coming in uh, like single line. Okay, this is a test string. You will get this. In. This is a test string. Okay, and uh, this is a test string. Okay, this uh, we are getting. And if you want these things in a, like a, for a space also, you can go for a space also if you require because I have put it here. If you want to replace something, or you can just go for this also. Like uh, you can just uh, put uh, your symbol icon, and you can replace it by space also. So I think you understand till and uh, you can just practice because in coding also now you need to just make the things uh, means as much you will practice you will uh, go for the different different cases you will find some new things okay so you can uh, practice also and now in uh, th this is a case to uh, like uh, if you want if you want to just uh, remove the extra spaces or uh, like uh, so what will you do see here I have put some extra space here and this extra space so before uh, splitting this one and to trim to remove the uh, spaces what i can do i can go for this one string two okay dot trim we have to use dot trim okay and it will remove the xi spaces which are in your uh, like uh, character or something uh, string okay so run as java application and you can see it here see here lots of let okay so xi spaces which are uh, this and this these all things removed okay and uh, before uh, before trimming the it was looking like this okay and after trimming it's look like this you can see it here uh, string two dot trim and then you have to use this bracket and it will remove your the blank spaces okay so this much only for today's video and i hope you will understand and uh, let's do practice and if any difficulties are coming just make comment i will just resolve that one okay so thanks for today take care all the best bye bye